DeSoto County, Mississippi, parents in one school are asking how far is too far to get a student's attention. It is all about this video. A couple of teachers at a North Mississippi school twerking in their classroom as the students watch and some of them laugh. Comments on the video have been both positive and negative. Local 24's Rudy Williams is live in our control room now with more on this story. What are people saying tonight, Rudy? Well, Cameron, thinking about it, uh, show and tell, a field trip, all ways to get students to pay attention. But this video has some saying, well, it's just dance. Others are saying and questioning the teacher's judgment in the classroom. Your child comes home and says his or her teacher twerked today. Okay with you? Uh, no. No, it's actually not. I don't think that's a way to demonstrate your lesson. You could, you should find another way than twerking. Is it a matter of taste? Because you got some students that are going to take it out of proportion and then go probably get it on film. That's exactly what happened when this video of Coach Greg Abernathy and Connie Lambert was posted on two social networking sites. Notice the girl's reaction in the front row. Another student verbalizes her shock. One thing this video has done for sure, it's got people talking on both sides of this issue. What followed these posts? A barrage of comments in favor of the teachers dirty dancing and against. Like this one from a Facebooker who knows them both. I don't care much for either teacher, IMO, they are both immature and annoying. It goes on. Another says, I took Abernathy, loved his class, but hate it when Lambert came over. But did this performance go too far? Now, we don't know how the school handled the situation. Today was a holiday and all offices were closed. Our calls to the communications director went unanswered. The teachers have a popular web broadcast. It's called Ab and Lamb, where there's a whole lot more dancing going on there. Live from the control room, I'm Rudy Williams, Local 24 News.